I guess what's funny to me is my dog can forgive me much better than I can forgive myself. Gotta love dogs and their unconditional love. Good morning, internet friends, or rather, good evening, internet friends. How are we doing today? How are we, buddy? Hey, I'm chewing on rope. Sassy's sleeping, and Riddler is your letting me on the bed. I am super frustrated right now because I am getting homework done for tomorrow, and I'm trying to download a stupid program that I need to finish one problem. And it is driving me up a freaking wall. And I feel bad because, like, the dogs were playing while I'm trying to do homework. So that added to my frustration because they were not quieting down. So I ended up yelling at them. And then my anxiety went up. I was trying to get MRL to alert to me scratching. And he did not alert. Which, of course, added even more to my frustration. Which, of course, Riddler was there. So that makes him distracted, which is even more frustrating. So I tried being like, okay, well, let me just settle down. Take a deep breath. We'll move on. Then MRL started drinking out of the toilet. Riddler has taught him that. And that, of course, got me mad. And then I was like, you know what? Maybe they need to go outside. So I took them outside. And then while Riddler was outside, I was trying to get MRL to do pressure across my lap. It took him a few times, but he finally got it. Which helped some. And then I went into the bathroom and just sat down, head in my hands. I was extremely anxious and frustrated. And little boy walked up to me and starts licking at my face like he knows something's up, but he doesn't know what. Of course, I still can't get him to alert. Or he thinks alert is using his nose this time for some reason. So I got very frustrated. <sighs> it's just been a very frustrating evening and the dogs just haven't helped. And it's all stemming from this stupid statistics homework that I'm just trying to get done. And it's driving me up a wall, so... <sighs> Yay! So I'm going to try to get this done and not murder my computer. And I'll check back in with you guys later. Hey guys, so I am slowly getting calmed back down. Anxiety's still shooting because, of course, heart rate's going. It doesn't help I drink some caffeine, too, so I'm like, Ugh. But I'm getting myself calmed down. After I finally got my homework done, I don't care if it's right or not at this point. I was like, you know... I will do something that I know I will succeed at. I will work on the vlog. So I got it worked on. It's uploading to YouTube right now. Things are going good. I put a couple of clips in there from my shoot for Close Enough Cosplay. Which, if you can't already tell, they're both me. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of fun. I enjoy doing it. Um... I realize I never took MRL on a public outing Tuesday. I want to try to do it tomorrow if I can, but we'll see what happens. Um, I also need to get a shower. Now that anxiety and frustration is starting to calm down, I'm starting to get really tired. Um, I just whacked a bug out of the air. No, oh, where's the bug? I heard the buzzy buzz. It's, it's like one of these black and red bugs. I don't really know what they're called. Um... I think they're potato bugs. I'm not really sure. But, um, you know how, like, also, if you're frustrated and then anxious, like, anything can irritate you? I got irritated because MRL went to go see my dad. And my dad made a joke about, um, that I wasn't giving him enough, giving puppy enough love. Which I know he's completely joking. And I mean, I would laugh about that. But because I was so anxious and frustrated from homework, I got offended by it. I'm just like, there's no reason. You don't need to get mad. There's absolutely no reason for you to get to be all like this. So, uh, the joys of homework screwing with you. So, I'm gonna go and get me a shower and try to get completely calmed back down before bedtime. Hey guys. Hey poppers. You feeling okay, sassy? Sassy was throwing up what looked like white foam. And from what I've looked up through Google, 
searching, although, I mean, obviously, the internet is not always right, but her symptoms mainly match up with just her having a cough and that the foam is just phlegm. Excuse you! No. 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 Guys, I love you. I am not having this anymore. Stop. No, stop. <sighs> Frustration is still high. Look, you can share the toy. I thought a shower would help. Apparently not. I shouldn't be so frustrated over two dogs yeah. playing. But, oh my gosh, it's just, they don't stop. And I know, the, the one thing that I have to remember is that they're both puppies. It's kind of hard to remember that with MRL, I mean not MRL, with Riddler sometimes. But he's a year old, he's still a baby. And I'm just like, ugh. I hate feeling this frustrated and this angry. Because I'm normally not this way. But homework started this whole thing. That's what I'll blame. We'll go with homework. I mean, homework is really annoying. But the unconditional love from a dog. So, MRL, I've yelled at him a lot today. Both him and Riddler. And yet he'll still come back to me with a wagging tail. With just completely forgiving me of me yelling at him. And threatening him with threats that I'm never going to do. Because, I mean, we all threaten our dogs with things that we know we're never going to do. So, I guess what's funny to me is my dog can forgive me much better than I can forgive myself. Gotta love dogs and their unconditional love. Now look at you two. See, you can play quietly. And you can each play with one end of the rope. See, that's called sharing. Which I know, Riddler, you don't always like to share. And now, MRL, explain this to me. You won't play tug of war with me. I have to tell you to pull. You'll play with your brother. Though Riddler really likes tug a lot more than you. He also likes fetch more than you. You're so weird, but I did ask that for my prospect to not end up like his brother. There's a lot of ways you're not like him. Oh, but I gotta tell you something super gross that MRL did. He brought a dead mouse to the front door. It was gross. So, I tried to give it to the cat. She didn't care, but I put it beside her food. Maybe she'll eat it later. I doubt it. But, uh, my dogs are weird. So now, hopefully, to get this frustration to subside, I'm going to sign up for the night and head off to bed. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Question of the day is, what do you do to calm back down when you're, like, angry or frustrated? Because I could really use some tips. Since I don't really experience anger a lot, it's really difficult for me to come back down from it. Because I have no idea what the heck to do with it. Just put your answers down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Good night, Emeril. Good night, Riddler. Good night, Sassy. Feel better, sweetheart.